Mr. Bigley. Hey there, it's Gerbigly, and today I'm playing a game called Mike and Monk, in which we take control of Mike, who is a human, and his friend Monk, who is a chipmunk, I'm assuming friend or pet. Anyway, let's go ahead, let's jump in. I believe this is like a platformer style game where we take control of two of them at the same time and have to use them to like activate switches and whatnot. All right, there are 30 stages. I have a feeling I'm not gonna get through all 30, but we can try. All right, so we start off level one as Mike, all right, X, J or X, I'm hitting. Oh, we actually have to punch it with our hands. Okay, and that made the spikes up here go down. All right, and it doesn't seem like there's a timer at least, so that's good. Oh, okay, replace character, press space, and that's how we swap over to Monk, and I lifted up that spike for him. Okay, and then we have to get them both to the exit before either of them can get out of there, and we do a little peace sign as Mike because we're across. All right, so smack that. That's good. All right, and then he can't get through that. I can't duck or anything. So only Monk can get through that because he's short enough. I <laughs> like the little squeaking noise he makes. All right, cool. And then uh, swap over. And then we're Mike again. And then, oh! Oh, that has a timer. What's that about? Oh, it's right on the button. I didn't notice that. That's ADHD for you. I did not notice there's a little countdown right on it before that little, like, spear drops again. Okay, so I'm assuming if we accidentally touch that, we get stabbed and die. I don't want to find out, though. Okay, so we have to be monkier? Can we make that jump? I don't think we can. Oh, Mike jumps really high. He's got ups. Never mind. I didn't realize that. Okay, so the spikes stay down permanently. It's just these spears that are the dangerous part. Okay, so Mike got across safely. Monk can make that jump. Very good. Okay. Pals reunited here at the exit. Very good stuff. Okay. This has a... Oh, oh my God. Okay. There's a cannon that's shooting stuff. I don't want to be here. Okay. So do I have to... Uh-oh. 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 No! Oh, and there's blood. Oh my gosh, how violent. Okay, so what if I swap over... Okay. So whatever's moving gets the, the distraction. Oh my god, that was so close. Holy cow. So we have to contend with evil cannons now as well? That was really that was really scary there for a moment. Okay, so swap over. So whatever's moving gets shot at the most, it looks like. They'll leave me alone. Oh no! Oh, poor little monk. I didn't mean for that to happen to our, our little monk. Oh no! <laughs> I didn't swap fast enough. Okay, so take a shot at me here. Take another shot, and then swap. And then they'll shoot only at Monk. Okay. Monk's getting over. Oh, no, Mike! You jumped too high, buddy. You got too big of ups. You got too big of ups, buddy guy. Okay. We got to get him over here. There we go. And then swap. And then Monk gets the button. Gets to the exit. Goes to Mike. Oh, okay. I can stand on that stuff. I thought I was going to, like, fall through and going to have to jump over that last part. We got through. Oh, my God. This is a little bit, uh, now that they've added these, uh, laser blasters. It's, oh, I forgot to jump down there. It's gotten a little bit more harrowing for the duo. All right. So, we have to be ready to go as, as Mike there. All right. Monks hit the button. Mike, you go. Get going, buddy. Get to the exit. All right. You did it. And then Monk should be okay to get across. Holy cow, this is what? Only level six or something? Yeah, because this is level seven. All right. He's got to get across here and punch this switch for his buddy. And then I have to hit the switch for him. Oh, my gosh. Okay, 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 okay. And smack that. Swap back over to the squirrel. Or the chipmunk. Why do I keep calling him a squirrel? His name's Monk, like chipmunk. This is the stress that these kinds of games bring me. Is I'm not thinking properly. I mean, that happens. Okay. So now they're not going to pay attention to him. Okay, wait. They're still paying attention to him. Why were you still shooting at the chipmunk? Oh, my gosh. Not supposed to be shooting at the chipmunk yet. Okay. So if I stand over here. Okay. I'm safe as monk. So can I... Wait for that to shoot. Jump up. No! Oh, I wanted to swap back. So, a lot of swapping back and forth is important in this, like, really rapid fire fast. So, that is something to keep in mind. Okay. Okay. Get him over there. Swap back. All right. He's safe. 
He's now jumped through. I don't think I have the time to get through here. Uh-oh. Am I going to get shot? Okay, those are safeties for me. Okay, no, we got this. We got this. We got this. Yes, teamwork makes that dream work. Holy cow, this has gotten complicated so quickly. We're not even at double-digit levels yet. I mean, we're almost there, but we're not quite. Okay, no, he's dead. He's so fried. He's not fried. No, go, 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 go. Oh, my God. Mike, you barely made it, bud. You barely made it. Oh, no, I needed him up there to punch the switch. To get Monk back up. All right, Monk, you have to sacrifice yourself so we can respawn. Oh, that was my own fault. Okay, here we go. No! Oh, my God, I was trying to, to juke it back and forth, but I didn't get the timing right because I wasn't positive of when the blast came through. Okay. Oh, it hit me my little tootsie. Okay, I think I think the, the rule of thumb here is just go for it. Oh, no! Ugh. Okay, maybe maybe bait them out with the squirrel first. Or maybe, here's the thing I do. I hit the button first. And then I think I can make it across. Yes, now I can make it across. And now they'll be distracted by the little squirrely boy. Now swap, punch it, go through. And we're safe. Holy cow, this game. There's a lot going on, a lot of different mechanics. I like it though. I like how complicated it is. It's very, very fun. It's just very difficult, especially with these laser shooty boys in the way. Can I run past those? That's the question. So this one's going to take a shot at me. But it's not going to shoot again right away. Okay, yep. I can. Oh no, I can't get back up though. I think I, I messed myself up. Alright. Ah, oh, Mike, you have to sacrifice yourself. So sorry, bud. Okay, so you can run past the laser cannon, which is good. I don't think I can make that jump though. So maybe I shouldn't do that first. Maybe what I should do is be Monk first. Uh-oh. Monk, run, run by these guys. All right. Oh, Monk's going to have to be the one to hit the switch this time. And we're going to have to pray that Mike doesn't get blown into bits. I see. Oh, my God. All right. So the one on the bottom isn't a threat because it can't shoot through the platform. I did not realize that. That's my bad. Holy cow. Holy cow. Okay. So Mike's got to get in position to jump on that. Mike, you fool. You missed it. You missed every every time, bud. Okay. Can I make that, though? Can I? Oh, I, I think I could have maybe made that. This is only level 10. Out of 30, this game gets very, very hard very quickly from, from the looks of it. Mike. Oh, my God. Monk and Mike, both of you have taken the risks that you don't need to take. Oh, boy. And by you don't need to take, I mean, this is the type of game where you kind of do have to take a bunch of them. It's fine. Okay, so only pay attention to the ones on top. Punch that switch. Okay. Monk made it across safe. Is at the doorway. We uh, hope and pray these laser blasters don't get us. And then get to the exit. Oh my god, this is like panicked franticness. Oh my god. And we have more traps. So not only do we have a laser cannon that's going to shoot homing things at us, but we also have these laser, like, walls and floors. So that's fun. All right, Mike, you got to get going, bud. You got to get going, bud. Okay, you made it across fine. Now it's Monk's turn. Can we line up the timing? There we go. Way to go, Monk. Monk was the MVP in that one. Holy cow. All right, this is one where... They're going to appear at random intervals and disappear at random intervals. So if we get right in between, we should be able to walk across. Oh my god, I was afraid of that for a moment. Got big afraid. Okay. No! Oh, I went a little bit too forward and we got some fried squirrel as a result of our efforts. Okay, so it's going to be sort of the middle ones right there. That was close. <laughs> Mike got it close as well. Holy cow, it's all about memorization. This is rough when you have ADHD. That's all I gotta say. I have ADHD, and it is uh, hard to pay attention to some of these little details here. All right, level 13. My lucky number, can I get through it without ending the lives of these very fine folk? Uh, we don't have any laser cannons this time, so that's good. No laser cannons to contest with. Some solid energy going on right there. What? Oh my god, I thought I made it through! 
I thought I made it through. Okay, that's a much quicker cooldown than I thought it was going to have. All right, that's fine. We're through that time. I cannot believe that that happened. Poor Mike. He did his best. He did his darndest. All right. You have to, like, just drop through right away as soon as you can here. This one's going to stink because it looks like these things are... Yep, they're on two separate timers. So that's going to be right there. And then just hope and pray that that one disappears quick enough to get through. Okay, that's one through. One buddy through. Okay. Now this time, play it close. Run, and then reunited. Level 13, my lucky number done. Knocked out of the park. This is level 14 here for you. It looks like a lot of electric floors. Looks like Monk's going to have to do a lot of the heavy lifting yet again on this level. But I'm going to have to end my video here. This was a lot of fun. It was very complicated, but it also has, obviously, really simplistic mechanics. So, mastering those just takes a little bit of practice, which is kind of fun to do. Hopefully, you had fun watching me get zapped and shot over and over again. If you did, please, please, please check this game out over here on lag.com. And as always, it was great seeing ya. Bye bye